I played a French super prop in War Thunder, the VB-10C. This plane has been on my radar for a while, but I have only just been able to fly it out and my word is it fun. With two engines, 20mm cannons and an air spawn, this thing is ridiculous. Very good hit! Yeah! Got him! Got him! Wait, 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 wait! <laughs> Subscribe for more and enjoy. Okay, City as our first match of the day. Now, the VB10. I've never played it before. Actually, no. I think I've played it a couple of times in air, uh, in Ground RP. But I, have got not, I haven't got any of the upgrades. I've never played this in Air RB. I have gone up against it. It's got incredible, in, in, incredible armament. Very, very good. And it climbs incredibly well from what I've seen. So... I suspect that we should be playing this as more of a energy fighter than anything else. So that's that's the vibe I'm going to go for today. I'm going to use it as a, a French P-51. The fact this thing gets an S-1 is crazy to me. So it's got two engines in it. Huh, that's really interesting. So it's almost like the, uh, the Dornier 335 in a sense. Except instead of having a propeller at the back, it's got two propellers at the front does that mean it has two oh, it does it does have two throttles wait hang on yes or no i haven't yet set up my propeller pitch um setting so i'm probably not going to touch manual engine control too much uh this video although i would like to be able to open up those radiators there's a poor b18 in it please tell me that you're in a squad with someone you're not oh my word i'm so ah no wait you're probably the Swedish B-18. Yeah. <laughs> ah, ah, that's a problem. <laughs> oh, hello, P-61. M multiple targets up ahead here as well. B-18, please do not dive on me. Right, you're a concern. I hope you don't go for me because I would like to try and get these guys while they're low. P-51 first. God, this thing's quite responsive, you know. All right, go on then. We do it. Hits, but nothing more. Anything on R6? Mm, Corsair, kind of. Right, he's down. Good. So the roll rate's fantastic. Um, elevator seems to lack a little bit, though. It is quick, though. If it's outrunning these sort of aircraft. Ah, oh, yes. They will start to catch up to me soon, though, because I'm completely unupgraded. So uh, what we'll have to do is... We shall start leveling out and we'll start thinking about returning to the combat zone. All right. Let's get some airspeed. Nice. He's down. Right. I'm hoping I can use this thing's two engines to my advantage here. I mean, it's bloody quick, isn't it? My word. Go on, 190. Get him. Nice. All right. I'm going to go up and help him. Actually, you know what? That, that elevator pitch is pretty damn good. Right. What's the plan here, dude? Good hit. Very good hit. That's what we like to see. <laughs> yes. Hello, 109. Yeah, get out of here. <laughs> right, let's cool that engine right down. Very surprised this Key 44 hasn't taken out the 109 earlier. Unless he's got no ammunition. No, he's definitely got ammunition. I think. Has he? Oh! <laughs> the... Well, I... Oh, what was he? I can't remember what he was. Was that the B-18? I feel like that was the B-18. Anyway, there's definitely a bomber up here that we need to uh, take care of. Ah, there he is. Yeah, I see him. We're going to win anyway on points, I think. Yeah, nice. Right, three kills in our first match. You know what? I reckon this is going to be really good fun. Kamchatka. Okay. So, I have actually uh, just set up my prop pitch um, controls. So... I'm going to give it a go. I'm going to give it a go and see what we can get out of the get out of this engine. So I'm going to side climb slightly over in this direction, I think. Stick it about a, about a 15 degree climb. Right, propeller pitch. All the way to 100%. There we go. That's better. That's better. Right, so we should be able to almost happily sit at, um, at this sort of level now and just wet. Also, in that first match, we unlocked probably about three... 
performance modification, so we shouldn't. It shouldn't take us too long to fully ace this. To be fun, to be honest with you. All right, water's slightly getting over overheated, so let's open to about sixty percent. This thing climbs incredibly well, very, very well. I know that you get the air spawn, so perhaps my um, impression is slightly tainted because of that. I mean, it is only, what is it, 12 meters per second climb rate, 13 now that I've got off a couple of upgrades. Oh, who lives in a pineapple under the sea? <laughs> oh, you can climb all you want. You can climb all you want. It ain't gonna make a difference. It ain't gonna make a dip. Oh. It might make a difference. <laughs> B25 is gonna try his luck as well. Fair play. Right, what's next? What else can I shoot at? I know they're behind me, but I'm not really concerned. I'm feeling this 109. Get out of it. Do you wanna go? Hit. Not good enough. Oh, okay, that got something on fire. Not sure what it was. It is heavy. It is a heavy plane. It's good, though. About there. Nope. All right. P61's next. Yes! <laughs> oh, we've got something in front of us. Oh, hello. Nope, not doing that. Those 50 cows have absolutely insane reach. You know what? For a plane that's so heavy as this, it turns really well. This might be a mistake, but... Oh, no, I don't think it is. Hello. I'm not sure what that was. He can outturn me here, no problem, but I can go up, I think, whereas he can't. Nice, got that P61 eventually. Let's have a look. Yeah, I mean, this engine's just so, so powerful. Yeah. Wow. Just wow. <laughs> That's immense. Oh, yeah, there was a... Uh... We haven't had to go off web at all this entire match. Oh, that 109's in trouble. <laughs> 109's in trouble. I'm going to pull off. There's no point losing airspeed over that. <laughs> you say him big doo-doo. <laughs> you say him big doo-doo. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Right, so that's the B25 down there. I'm not sure if you can see that on YouTube. Never mind. <laughs> wow. Wow. Three kills again. Wow. I'm really enjoying this plane. I didn't expect it to, um, or I didn't expect to enjoy it as much as I am. I'm really, really impressed. Okay, Ladoga. Interesting map. Uh, it's good good news for us because it means our engine will not overheat as much uh, at all. A little bit late, but that's okay. Mm, yes, dirt airfield on ice. Look how far ahead that Wyvern is. Mental. All right, T18B over there. Okay. And a B6. All right, I'm going to head over to intercept the T18. All right, you want to try and go? All right. All right, well, he got a hit on me and I didn't get a hit on him, so fair enough. Is he outturning me? No, it's kind of similar. All right. Well, that's equal now. Kind of. There we go, got him. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Little bit damaged, though. XP-50 doing XP-50 things as usual. I think I'm going to try and focus on this P-47. I'm going to flip this way a little bit so that they don't choose me as a primary target. Although that looks inevitable. All right, P-47's down. Oh, bugger off. Bring it down low where you don't like it. BF-109, is he going to go up? Kind of. Oh. Okay, no hits. Just got to keep getting lower and lower. Yep, very weak game for us. Unless we can get these two kills, but I doubt it. Definitely have to try and get those cannon upgrades. They're like shotguns. I'm going to be the XP-50's primary target, that's for sure. All right, let's loop. 
until he eventually bleeds his speed. Five degree climb, just so we get a little bit of altitude back every time we loop. They're in a squad together, so they're not going to want to necessarily bleed that speed. And down we go. Try and see if we can set them up for the A6M2. On the plus side, because they can't really come down... Let's help them. Let's see if we can do it. I don't think we'll be able to, but let's give it a go. Good hits. Come here. P61's going to come down. I can feel it. Yep. That was inevitable. You can't do that. Cool. I think I can outspeed a P uh, an XP50 on the deck. I think. Right. I'm going to risk it for a chocolate biscuit for the 190 to get a shot off on him. <laughs> get out of here! <laughs> <laughs> nice well done 109 very well done p47 last alive the 190 could potentially get him oh, i reckon that's the p47 done now isn't it surely wonder if we can maybe get some points on him critical hit that'll do me nice <laughs> that, that engagement went a lot better than I thought it was going to. <laughs> fair play. Only two kills, but fair play. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. City again. Nice. I'm not going to complain. I like the map. It's good. All right. All right. All right. Okay. A20 was the first one to pop up. PBJ and the B26 over there. Okay. 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 All right. P61 and a P2 up there. Okay, so the P61 is really our main primary threat. Mm, P61 is at our level. It's going to make this fight difficult. About here. All right, a hit. That's about it. We did defend the Sunderland, though. So that's a plus. Not sure for how long, but we have defended the Sunderland. What can we do here? Got him. Got him. Right, you're next. Come here. Sunderland can kind of defend for himself. I want to get these these two while they're nice and slow. Cool. You next? All right, maybe not. You're next. Good hits. No cigar. We should be faster than the F6F. Doesn't mean anything, though. Mm, let's try and get you. Oh, come on. All right, 109 is in trouble and so am i now apparently according to this can i use my energy to outpace him though that's the question so if i do this will he try and then come back around whoa did not see you there guess that's what he was waiting for are you gonna try and dogfight me all right do it Nope. All right. That's annoying because we actually had the uh, inside turn on him there. Incredibly. Nope. I'm not doing that. Have I got something behind me? Ah! <laughs> yes, I do. Yes, I do have something behind me. Uh, I think we're in trouble here. Come on. That'll do. Let's see if we can use the building to our advantage. Yeah, we kind of can. Yes, got him. Oh, I didn't see you there. God damn it. <laughs> Three kills again. What's going on? Ah, there was no team. Understood. Okay. Okay, Sicily. This could go one of two ways. Either it will be incredible for us or awful. There is no in between. Uh, it would be absolutely lovely if I could spawn sometime today. That'd be great, Gaijin. Seeing as other people are, are allowed to, but not everyone, apparently. I wonder if this bugs back. Do you remember when, um, was it Sky Guardian, something like that, dropped and nobody could spawn in? Yeah, okay. 
Well, that sucks. Oh, f thank you. I can finally spawn. Except there's going to be literally no enemies on the enemy team. Nice. Team kill as well. All right, there is an enemy bomber up there, which is good. Water's a little bit overheated. Let's give it to about 37%. All right. 54. 55% for the radiator. Right, let's get the PB4. Let's do it about there. Okay, well, he certainly got the better deal out of that. Hello. Okay, that did nothing. Oh, I'm not sure. Did it do something or not? Mm, I'm not really going to risk that. What's going on here then? I can't aim with tri with stealth rounds at all. That'll do. Oh. Okay. <laughs> it was the wrong plane. All right, that's fine. You should be going in anyway. Nice! P-51's down as well. Are you going to turn? Please turn. All right, severe. Not great, not terrible. Yep, he's in. Good. All right, I'm thinking of... Heading on the LA-5 to try and get our fourth kill. That's the vibe. Hit. Nothing substantial, though. Oh. Hits. Damage to elevator. What's the play here? I hear something else. P-47. Okay, he's not going to go for me just yet. Interesting. Will be soon, though. Yeah. Oh. No, we're not doing that. Where's he going? Can I do that? No, not quite. LA-5 actually could get me here, but I think I'm all right. Damn on. Good hits. Mm, 40 cannon rounds left. No, not gonna not gonna do that one. Very honorable. Come on. Yes! 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 Wait, I didn't even get an assist on the LA5. Get out of here. Oh yeah. Let's uh, open up that oil radiator. In fact, full. Yes. Yes. We have only got one engine. Ah, oh, I got the P-51. Four kills. Let's go. We do... Mm, I suppose the question is, do we have enough power from that one engine? Bring it back a little bit now. 55 degrees. I'm just wondering if we can maybe squeeze enough power out of that engine to get us home safely. I mean, surely that's the point of having two engines, right? Come on. Radiators, do your job. Right, nice. Let's get the gear down. And let's cut power. Attack enemy base. There we go. And touchdown. Good stuff. Yep, brakes. If you could do something today, that would be... Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> They did do something, but not the way I wanted it to do it. <laughs> Get your big ass off that runway. So the question is, where is the last person? They've got an kill, so they're definitely in an attacker or a fighter. Ah, uh, Yak-3. Okay. It's going to be a bit of a fight on our hands, but we can make it work. All right, let's see what he does here. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. No, I'm not going to take that kill. Right, well, we got our four kill game. So, uh, I shan't complain. That was a bit weird at the beginning there with the server problems, but it's a War Thunder or Gaijin product. Okay, so the VB-10C1 at 4.0. Um, yeah, it's a good aircraft. I've enjoyed playing it. Um, it isn't necessarily going to be the plane that gets you uh, an ace per game. Uh, you might do once every 10 games, something like that, 15 games. But it's a good plane. Um, by native French standards, 
it's a fantastic aircraft. Um, unfortunately, the majority of the French tech tree is littered with um, American and British aircraft, which un is understandable. Uh, but certainly as a late war or a late war native um, French aircraft, it's fantastic. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, the 20 mils light shotguns. Um, so the 600 cannon rounds go very quickly. Uh, the twin engine idea is really interesting. I like it. However, I feel like um, for what the aircraft is, it's still a little bit slow. Um, but outside of that, it's a great addition to your 4.0 lineup in the French tech tree. So I would, yeah, I would highly recommend it. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like below and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Until next time, take care.